Hi, I'm Jason and welcome to this week's Technique of the Week. Thanks for joining us. Uh, on this week's Technique of the Week, we're gonna be showing you an easy way to help clean a deactivator job uh, for exposed aggregate. We're gonna show you uh, how to get this stuff off the easy way and to clean it up a lot faster than just with the pressure washer. The key to this technique is using one of these uh, floor buffers, 17 inch floor buffer. Uh, some people call it a swing machine. These things are relatively cheap. We use them a lot of times for a lot of different applications. You've seen them in Technique of the Weeks before uh, where we use this. So it's a great tool. If you have one of these, you'll use it. Let's put it that way. So um, for this technique, what we're gonna do is take an attachment for the bottom of this. Um, that's a stiff bristle brush, okay? It's a polypropylene uh, scrub brush that uh, pretty coarse bristles. And what this is gonna do is this is spinning on there. It's gonna kind of loosen this up. That way when we pressure wash it, it washes off a lot easier. On this particular job, it'll probably save us like 30 minutes. But if you get on a big driveway or something like that, you know, th this method will save you hours of time. So it's a very cheap investment to, to save that much time. For those of you that aren't familiar with these machines, this has a plate on it. Uh, this has a normal key here that this goes in. So I'm just going to take it like that. We're going to put it on on there, and then we just spin it opposite direction of what it's reverse. So you just spin on there and it locks it in. We're going to get the surface a little bit wet and put some water on it. That's just going to help the machine so there's not so much friction. If we do it dry, uh, it's going to be hard to hold, hold the machine. So we're just going to put a little bit of water on it to wash it off a lot better or scrub it better. When you're working around, you know, finished product, brick, or whatever, or even on a driveway, another good thing to get in the practice of is after you scrub brush this, you have a lot of slurry, so it helps to have a guy pushing it off with a broom or a squeegee. That way, if I was just to take this and pressure wash it right now, this stuff would be up the wall, you know, five, 10 feet. Um, we have plastic everything off here, but still just, you know, this stuff's gonna go everywhere. So, you know, if you just take it and push it off, you know, I'm gonna create way less of a mess. Well, thanks for joining us this week on Technique of the Week. Hopefully that tip helps you with, with the buffer and scrubbing this. As you can see, it took off just the amount that we wanted to and left a nice, even uh, look without blowing a lot of stones off. Don't forget to, to like our Facebook page. And also, if you want to get these tips every week, go to www.techniqueoftheweek.org. It's real easy to sign up. Um, I got a little more dirty than I'd like to today, and I'm wet. But other than that, have a good rest of the week, and uh, we'll see you next time.